My group is responsible for supporting imaging studios uh, of Amazon. Uh, these are the studios in which we shoot image uh, of products that you see on the websites. So part of the team helps our studios uh, capture photographs efficiently and to take the best photographs possible. And we get photographs from many different sources. We have photographs we take ourselves. We have photographs that sellers send us to appear next to our products. How do we choose the right ones? And part of my role is to figure out how to use things such as machine learning and computer vision to automatically identify those images. I also think a great deal about how to take photographs from our studios and put them on the website without having to have anyone Photoshop them in between. So we can do that automatically using image processing algorithms. We have to keep uh, innovating and finding new ways of showing products to customers so that they can make better decisions. Because without great photographs, we can't sell products. People want to understand deeply the products that they're going to buy, so it's essential that we represent the product as, as realistically and with all of the functionality and things that you would want to see if you were holding that product in your hand. Like recently, uh, Amazon released something called Scale Images, wherein with image you can actually see how big an image is with respect to a person, so that you can decide, you know, if it's a toy you're buying for a kid, you know how, much, how big that toy really is. So the people who are successful here are those that are able to think big about incredibly difficult technical challenges having to do with imaging and are willing to take the risks in order to build systems that are truly extensible uh, to the kind of volumes that we have. I think there are actually two kind of people who are really successful in, in my org. One who show customer obsession and the second who really want to solve problems. We're solving real problems and at a scale that is almost unfathomable that we're looking at hundreds of millions of images per year. That is something that you just can't get anywhere else.